Focusing on your life through the lens of Buddhism can be a transformative journey, one filled with unexpected insights and profound revelations. Imagine unlocking the secrets to inner peace, where distractions and anxieties no longer control you. In this video, we will delve into the mysterious teachings of Buddhism, unveiling how its ancient wisdom can help you reclaim your focus and transform your life. From the elusive concept of root cause to the powerful truths hidden within the Four Noble Truths and the Eightfold Path, we'll guide you through practical steps to break free from the chains of attachment and distraction. What if the answers to your deepest questions have been waiting for you all along? Let's uncover the transformative power of Buddhist teachings. 1. Focus on Root Cause By understanding the root cause of our distractions, external distractions aren't the primary issue. It's our overstimulated minds seeking novelty and dopamine. Recognizing this helps us address the root cause of distraction and take meaningful steps toward a more focused, fulfilling life. The teachings of Buddhism have long addressed the nature of the mind and its tendencies. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this, and you will find strength. Similarly, Buddha emphasized mindfulness and the importance of inner tranquility. By drawing from these ancient sources, we can gain a deeper understanding of how to manage our thoughts and focus on what truly matters. The main purpose of this principle is to help you recognize that distractions come from within and to empower you to take control of your mind. The benefits are profound, reduce stress, improved productivity, and a greater sense of peace and fulfillment. By mastering your internal world, you can navigate external challenges with ease and focus on your personal growth and goals. 1. Set clear intentions. Start your day by setting clear intentions for what you want to achieve. This helps align your mind with your goals and reduces susceptibility to distractions. 2. Limit digital consumption. Set specific times for checking emails and social media. Use apps to monitor and limit your screen time. 3. Prioritize tasks. Use the Eisenhower matrix to categorize tasks by urgency and importance. Focus on high priority tasks and delegate or eliminate the rest. 4. Create a distraction-free environment. Designate a quiet, clutter-free space for work and relaxation. Remove unnecessary items that can divert your attention. Think of your mind as a garden. If you constantly plant seeds of distraction, you'll grow a tangled mess of weeds. But if you cultivate it with focus and purpose, it will flourish into a beautiful, serene space. Just as a gardener tends to their garden, you must tend to your mind removing weeds of distraction and planting seeds of intention and mindfulness. Deeper philosophical insights from Buddhism teach us that suffering often comes from our attachments and aversions. By practicing non-attachment and embracing the present moment, we can free ourselves from the cycle of craving and dissatisfaction. Of focusing on what is within our control aligns perfectly with this wisdom. By letting go of the need to constantly seek external validation or stimulation, we find peace within ourselves. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is crucial. When emotions run high, take a step back and breathe. Use techniques such as practice of negative visualization, imaging the worst case scenario to gain perspective and reduce anxiety. Rational thinking helps you stay grounded and make informed decisions while emotional balance ensures you remain calm and focused. Clarify the intent behind your actions. Why are you pursuing certain goals? What drives you? By understanding your long-term objectives, you can stay motivated and focused even when distractions arise. Remember, the journey is just as important as the destination. Embrace each step with mindfulness and intention. Create a conducive environment for focus and growth. Set up a dedicated space for meditation and reflection. Surround yourself with inspiring quotes and reminders of your goals. Incorporate elements of nature, such as plants or natural light, to create a calming atmosphere. Practical tips like these can significantly enhance your ability to focus and maintain inner peace. 2. Scatter focus. Recognizing that distractions come from within is the first step towards a more focused life. Our minds, overstimulated and constantly seeking novelty and dopamine, 
lead us astray. By addressing this internal root cause, we can harness the power of our minds and achieve true focus. Buddhism have long explored the nature of the mind. The Buddha taught mindfulness, emphasizing the importance of inner peace and presence. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this, and you will find strength. These teachings remind us that the key to focus lies within us, not in our external circumstances. The principle we're discussing serves to help you regain control over your mental focus. By understanding the concept of scatter focus, we embrace our mind's natural tendency to wander, leveraging it for increased creativity and productivity. This shift can lead to reduced stress, enhanced problem-solving abilities, and a more balanced life. 1. Schedule breaks. Incorporate short breaks between intense work periods. Use this time to let your mind wander freely without any specific agenda. 2. Engage in creative activities. Activities like drawing, playing a musical instrument, or taking a leisurely walk can stimulate scatter focus, allowing your mind to explore new ideas and solutions. 3. Limit overstimulation. Reduce excessive screen time and avoid constant multitasking. Allow your brain the space it needs to relax and wander naturally. 4. Reflect and journal. Spend a few minutes each day journaling your thoughts. This practice can help you process your mental meanderings and uncover valuable insights. Imagine your mind as a river. When you force it to flow in a rigid, straight path, it loses its natural vitality and creativity. However, when you allow it to meander and follow its course, it nourishes the surrounding landscape and brings life to everything it touches. Embracing scatter focus allows your mind to explore new territories, leading to innovative ideas and deeper understanding. Buddhist teachings emphasize the importance of non-attachment and being present. By allowing our minds to wander without judgment, we can achieve a state of flow and balance encouraging us to accept what we cannot control and focus on our inner world. This harmonious approach leads to a more fulfilling and focused life. Balancing emotional and rational thinking is crucial. When your mind wanders, it can evoke various emotions. Embrace these feelings without judgment, and then use rational thinking to integrate these insights into your daily life. Techniques such as deep breathing and mindful observation can help manage emotional responses and maintain focus. The purpose behind embracing scatter focus is to enhance your mental agility and creativity. By allowing your mind to wander, you open yourself to new perspectives and solutions. This approach aligns with long-term goals of personal growth and fulfillment as it nurtures both your rational and emotional faculties. Create a conducive environment for scatter focus. Designate a calm space where you can relax and let your mind wander. Surround yourself with elements that inspire creativity, such as art, music, or nature. Practical tips like these can help you cultivate an environment that supports mental exploration and focus. 3. Panoramic Vision Understanding that our distractions often come from within is crucial. One powerful way to manage these distractions and enhance our focus is by embracing panoramic vision. This approach involves dilating our gaze to process more information and avoid the pitfalls of overfocusing. By expanding our visual field, we can maintain attention without fixating on specific details, leading to better overall focus and productivity. Ancient philosophies like Buddhism provide valuable insights into managing our focus. The Buddha emphasized mindfulness, teaching us to observe without attachment. It's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. These teachings highlight the importance of broadening our perspective to maintain balance and focus. The primary purpose of adopting a panoramic vision is to prevent the tunnel vision that often leads to stress and decreased productivity. By broadening our gaze, we can process more information, stay attentive to our surroundings, and achieve a more balanced state of mind. This approach helps us avoid the pitfalls of over-focusing on minor details and instead appreciate the bigger picture. One, practice wide-angle viewing. Spend a few minutes each day practicing wide-angle viewing. 
Look straight ahead while consciously expanding your peripheral vision. Notice how much more you can see without moving your eyes. Two, take regular breaks. Every hour, take a short break to relax your eyes and shift your focus to a distant object. This helps prevent eye strain and refreshes your mind. Three, engage in outdoor activities. Spend time in nature where you can naturally practice panoramic vision. The expansive views will help train your mind to process broader fields of information. Four, mindful observation. Practice mindful observation by taking in your surroundings without focusing on any single detail. This helps cultivate a habit of panoramic vision in everyday life. Five, use visual aids. Place reminders in your workspace to practice panoramic vision. Posters, plants, or other visual cues can help you remember to broaden your gaze throughout the day. Think of your vision like a camera lens. When you zoom in too closely, you lose sight of the larger context, but by zooming out, you capture a wider, more comprehensive view. Panoramic vision allows you to take in more information, leading to better decision-making and a more balanced perspective. Buddhist teachings on mindfulness and non-attachment align perfectly with the concept of panoramic vision. By observing without fixation, we maintain a calm and focused mind, encouraging us to accept what we cannot control and focus on the broader picture. This balanced perspective helps us stay grounded and attentive. Balancing emotional and rational thinking is key to maintaining panoramic vision. When emotions run high, take a step back and breathe. Use techniques like the practice of negative visualization to gain perspective and reduce anxiety. Rational thinking helps you stay grounded and make informed decisions, while emotional balance ensures you remain calm and focused. Clarifying the intent behind your actions is essential. Why are you pursuing certain goals? What drives you? By understanding your long-term objectives, you can stay motivated and focused even when distractions arise. Remember, the journey is just as important as the destination. Embrace each step with mindfulness and intention. Create an environment conducive to panoramic vision. Arrange your workspace to encourage a broader view, avoiding clutter that can lead to overfocusing. Incorporate elements of nature such as plants or natural light to create a calming atmosphere. Practical tips like these can significantly enhance your ability to focus and maintain inner peace. 4. Rediscover boredom. In our modern world of constant stimulation, rediscovering boredom is crucial. By allowing ourselves to embrace boredom, we create valuable space for growth and innovation. Instead of fearing these idle moments, we should let our minds wander. This practice can lead to unexpected insights and a renewed sense of focus. The concept of embracing boredom aligns with ancient philosophical teachings. The Buddha emphasized mindfulness and the importance of observing our thoughts without judgment. It is not that we have a short time to live, but that we waste a lot of it. These teachings remind us that by embracing stillness and boredom, we can reclaim our time and use it more wisely. The purpose of this principle is to highlight the importance of boredom as a catalyst for creativity and self-discovery. When we resist the urge to fill every moment with activity or distraction, we open ourselves up to new ideas and deeper reflections. The benefits are clear. Enhanced creativity, improved problem-solving skills, and a more profound understanding of ourselves and our surroundings. 1. Schedule downtime. Intentionally set aside time each day to do nothing. Allow yourself to sit quietly without any distractions. This can be as simple as sitting on your porch or lying on your bed without a phone or book. 2. Limit digital distractions. Reduce your screen time and resist the urge to check your phone during moments of idle time. Allow these moments to be opportunities for your mind to wander freely. 3. Engage in simple activities. Activities such as walking, gardening, or knitting can provide a backdrop for your mind to wander while keeping your body gently engaged. 4. Reflect and journal. Use these periods of boredom to reflect on your thoughts and feelings. Journaling can help you capture insights and ideas that emerge during these quiet moments. Imagine your mind as a fertile garden. In a constantly busy state, 
there is no time for new seeds of ideas to take root and grow. Boredom acts as the nourishing soil that allows these seeds to sprout and flourish. By embracing stillness, we create the conditions for creativity and innovation to thrive. Philosophical insights from Buddhism emphasize the value of non-attachment and being present in the moment. By practicing mindfulness and embracing boredom, we can free ourselves from the cycle of constant stimulation and craving encouraging us to find contentment in simplicity and stillness. This balance fosters a deeper sense of peace and focus. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is essential. When faced with boredom, we might initially feel discomfort or restlessness. Recognize these emotions without judgment and allow them to pass. Techniques such as deep breathing and mindfulness can help manage these emotional responses. Rational thinking will guide you to understand the value of these quiet moments and how they contribute to your overall well-being. Clarify the intent behind your actions. Why are you seeking constant stimulation? What are you trying to avoid? By understanding these motivations, you can make more mindful choices about how you spend your time. Embrace boredom as an opportunity to reconnect with your inner self and long-term goals. Create an environment that encourages stillness and reflection Designate a quiet space in your home where you can retreat to embrace boredom. Minimize clutter and distractions in this area to support a serene atmosphere. Adding elements of nature such as plants or a small water feature can enhance the sense of calm and provide a soothing backdrop for contemplation. Practical steps like these can help you rediscover the value of boredom and its role in fostering creativity and focus. Five. Attention shapes life. Recognizing that the quality of your attention shapes your experiences and ultimately your life is a powerful realization. By cultivating mindful awareness, you can direct your focus intentionally and create a more fulfilling and meaningful existence. This principle teaches us that where we place our attention significantly impacts our overall well-being and success. Ancient philosophical teachings from Buddhism have long emphasized the importance of mindful awareness. The Buddha taught, what you think, you become. What you feel, you attract. What you imagine, you create. We are disturbed not by what happens to us, but by our thoughts about what happens. These teachings remind us that our attention and focus are crucial in shaping our experiences. The primary purpose of cultivating mindful awareness is to enhance the quality of our lives by intentionally directing our focus. By doing so, we can experience greater clarity, reduced stress, and a deeper sense of purpose. The benefits are vast, improved relationships, increased productivity, and a more profound connection with ourselves and the world around us. One, practice daily meditation. Dedicate a few minutes each day to meditation. Focus on your breath and observe your thoughts without judgment. This practice helps train your mind to remain present and attentive. Two, set clear intentions. Begin each day by setting clear intentions for what you want to achieve. This helps align your attention with your goals and priorities. Three, limit distractions. Create an environment that minimizes distractions. Turn off unnecessary notifications. Set boundaries for social media usage and designate specific times for focused work. Four, engage in mindful activities. Incorporate activities such as yoga, tai chi, or mindful walking into your routine. These practices help you stay present and cultivate a deeper awareness of your body and mind. Five, reflect and journal. Take time to reflect on your day and journal your thoughts and experiences. This practice allows you to process your emotions and gain insights into how your attention shapes your life. Think of your attention like a spotlight. When you focus it on a particular area, that area becomes illuminated, revealing details and insights that might otherwise go unnoticed. By intentionally directing this spotlight, you can highlight the aspects of your life that truly matter, leading to greater fulfillment and success. Buddhist teachings emphasize the value of mindfulness and being present in the moment. By practicing mindful awareness, we can break free from the cycle of distraction and stress and instead experience a state of inner peace and clarity. 
Buddhism complements this approach by encouraging us to focus on what is within our control and to accept what we cannot change. This balanced perspective helps us stay grounded and resilient. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is essential. When faced with challenging situations, use mindfulness techniques to observe your emotions without being overwhelmed by them. Rational thinking will guide you to make informed decisions and maintain a clear focus on your goals. Techniques such as deep breathing and grounding exercises can help manage emotional responses and keep your attention centered. Clarify the intent behind your actions. Why are you pursuing certain goals? What drives you? By understanding your motivations, you can direct your attention more effectively and make choices that align with your long-term objectives. Remember, the quality of your attention determines the quality of your experiences and, ultimately, your life. Create an environment that supports mindful awareness. Designate a quiet space for meditation and reflection. Surround yourself with elements that inspire calmness and focus, such as soothing colors, natural light, and meaningful objects. Practical steps like these can help you cultivate a mindful awareness that enhances your ability to direct your attention intentionally and shape a fulfilling life. 6. No Mediocrity In Buddhism, the principle of focus is paramount. By centering our attention, we cultivate a peaceful mind and purposeful life. The teachings of the Buddha emphasize the power of concentration, or samadhi, as a path to enlightenment. Historically, Buddhist teachings have underscored the significance of a focused mind. The Dhammapada states, the mind is everything, what you think you become. This ancient wisdom teaches us that our focus shapes our reality. The main purpose of this principle is to guide individuals in avoiding distractions and reducing stress. By maintaining focus, we can lead more fulfilling and meaningful lives. The benefits are numerous. Enhanced productivity, improved mental clarity, and a greater sense of peace. To implement this principle, start by define what is truly important in your life and commit to it. Next, practice mindfulness meditation daily. This practice trains the mind to remain present and focused. Lastly, limit distractions by creating a conducive environment. Turn off notifications, designate specific times for deep work, and ensure your workspace is tidy. Imagine a magnifying glass. When focused, it can harness the sun's rays to ignite a fire. Similarly, a focused mind can achieve extraordinary things. Think of your mind as this magnifying glass, capable of immense power when directed properly. Delving deeper, Buddhist philosophy teaches that a scattered mind leads to suffering. By aligning our thoughts with our actions, we achieve harmony and balance. As the Buddha said, just as a solid rock is not shaken by the storm, even so the wise are not affected by praise or blame. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is crucial. When faced with challenges, pause and reflect. Use techniques like deep breathing to calm the mind. This balance allows for thoughtful and deliberate actions. The intent behind focusing is to live with intention and purpose. Long-term goals become achievable when we dedicate our attention to them. Create a space that supports your focus. This could be a quiet room, a serene garden, or any environment where you feel at peace. Regularly declutter and organize this space to maintain its tranquility. Never settle for mediocrity. Strive for greatness in every endeavor. Remember, mediocrity is the enemy of progress. Aim high and keep your focus sharp. 7. Interoception Interoception is the ability to understand and sense the internal state of your body. It's a crucial aspect of maintaining focus and achieving a balanced life. By paying attention to your emotions, physical sensations and thoughts, you can significantly reduce distractions and stress. This practice is not only about self-awareness, but also about rewiring your brain for better emotional regulation and mental clarity. In today's fast-paced world, where distractions are everywhere, mastering interoception can help you stay centered and focused on what truly matters in your life. Adopting interoception as a strategic approach involves integrating mindfulness into your daily routine. 
This isn't about making drastic changes, but about making subtle yet profound shifts in how you perceive and react to your internal experiences. By consistently practicing interoception, you can develop a heightened sense of self-awareness, allowing you to navigate life's challenges with greater ease and composure. The concept of interoception is deeply rooted in Buddhist teachings. Buddhism emphasizes the importance of mindfulness and being present in the moment. The Buddha taught that understanding the nature of our thoughts and sensations is key to achieving enlightenment. One relevant quote is from the Dhammapada. Mindfulness is the path to the deathless. Heedlessness is the path to death. The mindful do not die. The heedless are as if dead already. This highlights the significance of being mindful of our internal states as a way to live a more fulfilling life. Reduced stress. By recognizing and addressing internal sensations, you can mitigate stress before it escalates. Improved focus. Understanding your mental and emotional state helps you stay focused on your goals. Enhanced emotional regulation. Better awareness of emotions leads to more effective management of emotional responses greater self-awareness. This practice fosters a deeper understanding of yourself, leading to personal growth and development. To practice interoception, follow these steps. 1. Set aside time. Dedicate a few minutes each day to focus solely on your internal state. 2. Find a quiet space. Choose a quiet environment free from distractions. 3. Focus on breathing. Begin with deep, slow breaths to calm your mind. Four, scan your body. Mentally scan your body from head to toe, noting any sensations. Five, acknowledge emotions. Pay attention to any emotions that arise without judgment. Six, reflect on thoughts. Observe your thoughts, allowing them to pass without attachment. Seven, repeat daily. Consistency is key. Make this a daily practice to build and maintain interoceptive awareness. Think of interoception as tuning into a radio frequency. When you first start, the signal might be weak and filled with static, but as you practice, you fine-tune the frequency and the signal becomes clearer. Your internal state is like that radio signal. With practice, you can tune into it more clearly and respond appropriately. In Buddhism, the practice of interoception aligns with the concept of vipassana, or insight meditation. This form of meditation encourages practitioners to observe their thoughts and sensations without attachment, fostering a deep understanding of the impermanent nature of all things. By cultivating this awareness, you can achieve a state of equanimity and inner peace. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is essential for maintaining focus. Techniques such as mindful breathing and body scans help regulate emotions allowing you to respond to situations more rationally. This balance is crucial for making thoughtful decisions and avoiding impulsive reactions. Understanding the intent behind your actions helps you stay aligned with your long-term goals. By practicing interoception, you become more aware of your motivations and can ensure that your actions are purposeful and directed towards achieving your life objectives. Create a conducive environment for practicing interoception by setting up a dedicated space for meditation or mindfulness. This space should be quiet, comfortable, and free from distractions. Use calming elements such as soft lighting, soothing music, or nature sounds to enhance the experience. Regular practice in this space will help reinforce the habit of interoceptive awareness. Eight, deliberate action. Deliberate action is about intentionally working toward your dreams understanding that each step you take matters. In a world filled with distractions, focusing on deliberate actions can make the difference between merely wishing for a better life and actually achieving it. By being mindful and purposeful in your actions, you align your daily activities with your long-term goals, ensuring that every effort contributes to your overall success. To incorporate deliberate action into your life, adopt a strategic perspective that involves setting clear, actionable goals. Break down your dreams into smaller, manageable tasks and tackle them one step at a time. This approach not only keeps you focused, but also provides a sense of accomplishment as you progress. Regularly review and adjust your actions to stay on track, 
ensuring that every step you take is purposeful and aligned with your objectives. The concept of deliberate action is echoed in Buddhist teachings. Buddhism emphasizes right action as one of the elements of the Noble Eightfold Path. This principle encourages individuals to engage in actions that are purposeful and aligned with ethical and spiritual goals. A relevant quote from the Buddha is, Just as a solid rock is not shaken by the storm, even so, the wise are not affected by praise or blame. This highlights the importance of steadfast, deliberate actions, regardless of external circumstances. Clarity of purpose understanding what you want to achieve and why. Increased motivation. Seeing progress with each deliberate step boosts your motivation. Enhanced productivity. Focusing on meaningful tasks improves your efficiency. Personal growth. Overcoming challenges through deliberate action fosters personal development. One, define your dreams. Clearly articulate what you want to achieve. Two, Set specific goals. Break down your dreams into specific, measurable goals. Three, create a plan. Develop a detailed plan outlining the steps needed to reach your goals. Four, prioritize tasks. Focus on high priority tasks that have the most significant impact. Five, take consistent action. Work on your tasks daily, no matter how small the step. Six, reflect and adjust. Regularly review your progress and make necessary adjustments to stay on course. Imagine building a house. Each brick you lay represents a deliberate action towards constructing a solid structure. If you skip steps or lay bricks haphazardly, the house won't stand. Similarly, each intentional action you take builds the foundation of your dreams, ensuring they become a reality. In Buddhism, Deliberate action can be seen as part of the practice of mindfulness and right effort. It involves being fully present in each moment and committing to actions that lead to spiritual and personal growth. This mindful approach ensures that every step taken is meaningful and directed towards a higher purpose. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is essential for effective deliberate action. Techniques such as mindful meditation and journaling can help you stay emotionally grounded while maintaining a clear focus on your goals. This balance enables you to navigate challenges with resilience and make well-informed decisions. Understanding the intent behind your actions ensures that they are aligned with your long-term goals. Each deliberate action should reflect your core values and aspirations, guiding you toward a fulfilling and purposeful life. Create an environment conducive to deliberate action by minimizing distractions and setting up a dedicated workspace. Ensure this space is organized and inspiring with tools and resources readily available to support your goals. Regularly declutter and refresh this space to maintain a productive and motivating atmosphere. Nine, disconnect. Disconnecting from the internet and reducing screen time is crucial for mental well-being in today's digital age. Constant connectivity can lead to information overload, stress, and distraction. By intentionally disconnecting, you create space for reflection and mental rejuvenation, which is essential for maintaining focus on your life goals. This principle helps you regain control over your time and attention, allowing for a more balanced and centered existence. Adopting a strategic approach to disconnecting involves setting clear boundaries for screen time and internet use. This means designating specific times for being offline and engaging in activities that do not involve screens. By planning and committing to these offline periods, you ensure that you have regular opportunities for mental rest and reflection. This strategy not only reduces stress, but also enhances your ability to concentrate on what truly matters. The concept of disconnecting has roots in Buddhist teachings which emphasize the importance of mindfulness and being present in the moment. The Buddha often spoke about the dangers of attachment, including attachment to distractions. One relevant quote is, the root of suffering is attachment. This wisdom highlights the need to detach from the constant barrage of digital stimuli and focus on the present. By doing so, we can find inner peace and clarity. The main purpose of disconnecting is to create mental space for rejuvenation and deeper reflection. The benefits include reduced stress, 
Less screen time leads to lower levels of stress and anxiety. Improved focus. Disconnecting helps you concentrate better on tasks and goals. Enhanced creativity. Mental space allows for creative thinking and problem solving. Better relationships. More offline time fosters stronger, more meaningful connections with others. To practice disconnecting, follow these steps. One, set boundaries. Establish specific times of the day to be offline. Two, create no screen zones. Designate areas in your home where screens are not allowed. Three, engage in offline activities. Spend time on hobbies, reading, or nature walks. Four, practice mindfulness. Use offline time for meditation and mindfulness practices. Five, schedule digital detoxes. Plan regular periods, such as weekends, for extended digital breaks. Six, reflect daily. Use the time offline to reflect on your thoughts and feelings. Think of your mind as a garden. Constant screen time is like a storm that floods the garden, making it difficult for flowers to grow. Disconnecting is like giving your garden the sunshine and space it needs to thrive. By reducing the storm of digital distractions, you allow your mind to flourish and grow in clarity and creativity. In Buddhism, the practice of mindfulness encourages individuals to be fully present in each moment. Disconnecting from the internet aligns with this practice by removing distractions and allowing you to focus on your inner experiences. This mindful approach leads to greater self-awareness and a deeper understanding of your thoughts and emotions. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is easier when you're not constantly bombarded by digital stimuli. Techniques such as deep breathing, meditation, and spending time in nature help calm the mind and bring emotional balance. This state of balance enables you to make rational decisions and respond to life's challenges with greater resilience. Understanding the intent behind your actions ensures they align with your long-term goals. By disconnecting, you create intentional space for activities that support your personal and professional growth. This purposeful approach helps you stay focused on what truly matters, leading to a more fulfilling and meaningful life. Create an environment conducive to disconnecting by setting up screen-free zones in your home. Make these areas comfortable and inviting with books, art supplies, or other offline activities readily available. This intentional space encourages regular breaks from screens and supports your efforts to disconnect and rejuvenate your mind. 10. Happiness. Happiness is not solely about achieving goals or reaching destinations. It's about appreciating the moments between challenges and finding joy in the journey itself. In the pursuit of success, we often overlook the small daily experiences that bring true contentment. By focusing on these moments, we can cultivate a deeper sense of happiness and fulfillment in our lives. To embrace happiness, adopt a perspective that values the journey as much as the destination. This involves being mindful of the present moment and appreciating the experiences along the way. By recognizing and celebrating small victories, you can maintain a positive outlook and stay motivated, even when facing obstacles. Buddhist teachings emphasize the importance of finding joy in the present moment. The Buddha said, there is no path to happiness. Happiness is the path. This wisdom encourages us to seek happiness in our daily lives rather than waiting for future achievements. By practicing mindfulness and gratitude, we can discover happiness in the here and now. The main purpose of appreciating the journey is to find lasting happiness and satisfaction. The benefits include increased gratitude. Recognizing the value of everyday moments fosters gratitude. Enhanced well-being. Enjoying the journey reduces stress and improves overall well-being. Greater resilience. Finding joy in small things helps you stay resilient during tough times. Sustained motivation. Celebrating progress keeps you motivated to continue working toward your goals. 1. Practice mindfulness. Pay attention to the present moment and your immediate experiences. 2. Celebrate small wins. Acknowledge and appreciate your progress no matter how minor. 3. Cultivate gratitude. Keep a gratitude journal to reflect on positive experiences daily. 4. 
Engage in enjoyable activities. Make time for hobbies and activities that bring you joy. Five, reflect regularly. Take moments to reflect on your journey and recognize the joy it brings. Imagine life as a long hike. If you only focus on reaching the peak, you miss the beauty of the trail, the flowers, the birds, the fresh air. Happiness is found in noticing and appreciating these details along the way. In Buddhism, the practice of mindfulness helps us stay present and appreciate the moment. By focusing on the here and now, we can find joy in everyday experiences and achieve a deeper sense of fulfillment. This approach aligns with the belief that happiness is not a destination, but a way of traveling through life. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is essential for appreciating the journey. Mindfulness practices such as meditation help regulate emotions, allowing you to experience joy more fully. This balance ensures that you remain grounded and centered, enhancing your overall sense of happiness. Create an environment that encourages mindfulness and joy. Surround yourself with things that bring you happiness photos, plants, music, Designate spaces for reflection and relaxation, making it easier to appreciate the present moment and find joy in your daily life. 11. Smooth Episodes Celebrating the smooth parts of your journey is crucial for maintaining motivation and a positive outlook. These are the small victories, moments of flow and progress you make along the way. Recognizing and appreciating these smooth episodes helps you stay focused and resilient even when challenges arise. By celebrating these moments, you reinforce your commitment to your goals and cultivate a sense of joy and fulfillment in your daily life. To incorporate this principle into your life, adopt a perspective that values and acknowledges every step forward, no matter how small. This means setting aside time to reflect on your achievements and appreciating the ease and flow you experience during certain periods. By doing so, you build a reservoir of positive experiences that can sustain you through tougher times. In Buddhist teachings, the concept of mindfulness encourages individuals to be fully present and aware of their experiences. The Buddha said, Do not dwell in the past. Do not dream of the future. Concentrate the mind moment. This wisdom teaches us to appreciate the smooth episodes, embracing the joy and satisfaction they bring without getting lost in past regrets or future anxieties. Increased motivation. Recognizing progress keeps you motivated and engaged. Celebrating victories, no matter how small, builds self-confidence. Enhanced resilience. Positive experiences provide strength during challenging times. Improved mental health. Focusing on positive moments reduces stress and anxiety. To practice celebrating smooth episodes, Follow these steps. Reflect daily. Spend a few minutes each day reflecting on your achievements and moments you flow. 2. Keep a journal. Document your small victories and positive experiences with others. Celebrate by sharing it with friends or family. 4. Reward yourself. Treat yourself to something enjoyable when you reach a milestone. 5. Stay present. Practice mindfulness to fully experience and appreciate smooth as they occur. Think of your journey like sailing on a vast ocean. While there may be storms and rough waters, there are also times when the sea is calm and the wind is at your back. Rating these smooth episodes, it's like enjoying the tranquil, easy sailing moments, which make the journey worthwhile. In Buddhism, the practice of appreciating the present moment aligns with the idea of celebrating smooth episodes by focusing on the here and now, you can fully experience the joy and satisfaction of your achievements. This mindfulness practice helps you cultivate a deeper sense of peace and regardless of external circumstances. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is essential for recognizing and celebrating smooth episodes. He Mindfulness practices such as meditation and deep breathing regulate emotions, allowing you to appreciate positive moments more fully. This balance ensures that you remain grounded and centered, enhancing your overall sense of well-being. Create an environment that supports the celebration of smooth episodes 
by surrounding yourself with reminders of your achievements. Display photos, certificates, or mementos accomplishments. Designate a space for reflection and relaxation, where you can regularly take time to appreciate your progress and savor the moments of flow and ease in your journey. Ship. Companionship is essential for a fulfilling life. Our relationships with others provide support, joy, and a sense of belonging. Being grateful for companions and helping others not only enriches our own lives, but also fosters a community of mutual support and growth. Recognizing the value of these connections helps us appreciate the shared experiences that contribute to our well-being. And to cultivate meaningful companionship, adopt a strategic approach that emphasizes gratitude and intentionality in your relationships. This involves actively expressing appreciation, help, and spending quality time with those who matter. By nurturing these connections, you build a network of support that enhances your life and provides a foundation for mutual growth and happiness. In Buddhist teaching, companionship is highlighted in the concept of Sangha, the community of practitioners who support each other on the path to enlightenment. The Buddha said, friendship is the whole of the spiritual life. It underscores the significance of having companions who share your values and goals, helping each other navigate life's challenges with wisdom and compassion. The primary purpose of valuing companionship is to create a supportive and enriching life experience. The benefits include enhanced well-being. Positive relationships contribute to emotional and mental health. Not having grass and happiness, sharing experiences and helping others brings joy and fulfillment. Strong companions provide support during difficult times. Personal growth, learning from others' perspectives and experiences fosters personal development. To foster meaningful companionship, Follow these steps. One, express gratitude. Regularly thank your companion for presence and support. Two, offer help. Be proactive in assisting others, showing that you care. Three, spend quality time. Make time for meaningful interactions and shared activities. Four, listen actively. Show genuine interest in other experiences and feelings. Five, celebrate together acknowledge and celebrate each other's achievements and milestones think of your life journey as a hike through a vast forest while you can walk the path alone having companions makes the journey more enjoyable and less daunting they help you navigate difficult terrain share the beauty of the surroundings and provide support when needed companionship enriches the hike making it a more fulfilling and memorable experience in Buddhism, the Sangha is a vital aspect of spiritual practice. Companionship in this context means supporting each other in mindfulness and ethical living. By fostering such connections, we create an environment of mutual growth and compassion, enhancing our own practice and the well-being of the community. This interconnectedness reminds us that we are not alone in our journey and that together we can achieve greater harmony and enlightenment. Balancing emotions and rational thinking is crucial in maintaining healthy relationships. Practices like mindfulness and compassionate communication help manage emotions, allowing for more constructive and supportive interactions. This balance ensures that relationships are based on mutual respect and understanding, enhancing the quality of companionship. Create an environment that fosters companionship by organizing regular gatherings, whether in person or virtually. Encourage open and honest communication and design spaces that are welcoming and conducive to shared activities. By intentionally creating opportunities for connection, you strengthen the bonds of companionship and enrich your life with meaningful relationships. 13. Obsession. The Buddha once said, the mind is everything. What you think, you become. This ancient wisdom underscores the power of focus and mental clarity. Buddhism encourages us to detach from worldly distractions and connect with our inner selves, seeking peace and enlightenment. The main purpose of this principle is to empower individuals to live consciously and purposefully. By focusing on one's life, we can reduce stress, improve mental well-being, and achieve greater clarity in our goals. The benefits include a more balanced life, heightened awareness, and a deeper sense of fulfillment. One. Mindful breathing. 
Start each day with mindful breathing exercises. This simple practice helps center your thoughts and brings attention to the present. Two, set clear intentions. Define your daily goals and long-term aspirations. Writing them down can reinforce your commitment. Three, limit distractions. Identify and eliminate distractions, whether digital, environmental, or social. Create a focused environment that supports your goals. Four, practice meditation. Regular meditation cultivates a calm mind and enhances concentration. It helps you remain grounded amidst life's chaos. Think of your mind as a garden. If you constantly plant seeds of worry and distraction, you will only reap a tangled, overgrown mess. But if you plant seeds of focus and positivity, you'll grow a garden of peace and purpose. Buddhism teaches the concept of impermanence, reminding us that distractions and stress are temporary. By understanding this, we can navigate life with greater ease and not be overwhelmed by temporary setbacks. As the Dalai Lama said, we can never obtain peace in the outer world until we make peace with ourselves. Balancing emotions with rational thought is key to focusing on your life. Techniques like deep breathing, mindfulness, and reflective journaling can help manage emotional responses, ensuring they do not cloud your judgment. Every action should be aligned with your higher purpose. Buddhism encourages us to act with compassion and intention, understanding that our actions shape our reality. Focus on what truly matters and let go of what does not serve your growth. Create a serene space for reflection and meditation. This environment, whether a quiet corner in your home or a natural setting, will support your journey toward focus and clarity. Practical tips include decluttering, setting a regular meditation schedule, and surrounding yourself with positive influences. 14. Inner Balance Buddhism emphasizes the importance of the middle way, a path that avoids extremes and seeks balance in all things. The Buddha taught that suffering often arises from imbalance, whether through excessive desire, aversion, or ignorance. As the Dhammapada states, better than a thousand hollow words is one word that brings peace. This reflects the Buddhist ideal of cultivating a peaceful, balanced mind as the cornerstone of a focused and purposeful life. The purpose of achieving inner balance is to enhance our ability to concentrate, make wise decisions, and navigate life's challenges with grace. Inner balance fosters emotional resilience, mental clarity, and physical well-being. The benefits include reduced stress, improved relationships, increased productivity, and a deeper sense of inner peace. One, mindfulness practice. Start with daily mindfulness meditation. This practice helps you become aware of your thoughts and emotions without being overwhelmed by them. It creates a space between stimulus and response, allowing for thoughtful actions. Two, emotional regulation. Recognize and acknowledge your emotions without judgment. Techniques like journaling or talking with a trusted friend can help process feelings and prevent them from disrupting your focus. Three, physical health. Engage in regular physical activities such as yoga, walking, or any exercise that you enjoy. Physical health is closely linked to mental well-being and focus. Four, balance diet and rest. Maintain a balanced diet and ensure adequate rest. These are crucial for sustaining energy levels and mental clarity. Five, Setting priorities. Clearly define your priorities and values. This helps in making decisions that are aligned with your true purpose, reducing the mental clutter that often leads to stress and distraction. Imagine your life as a ship navigating through the ocean. Inner balance is the keel that keeps the ship steady, even in rough waters. Without this balance, the ship would easily be tossed about by waves, losing direction and purpose. Similarly, without inner balance, we become vulnerable to external pressures and internal turmoil. The concept of impermanence in Buddhism teaches us that all things are transient. This understanding helps us not to cling too tightly to fleeting emotions or situations, thus maintaining balance. Thich Nhat Han once said, smile, breathe, and go slowly. This simple yet profound advice encourages us to approach life with calmness and mindfulness, ensuring that we do not get swept away by life's ups and downs. Balancing emotions with rational thought is critical. Techniques such as cognitive behavioral therapy, CBT, 
can be useful in challenging irrational thoughts and fostering a more balanced perspective. Additionally, regular self-reflection and meditation can help in maintaining this balance, ensuring that emotions do not dominate our decision-making process. Our actions should reflect our inner balance and align with our long-term goals. This alignment ensures that we are not merely reacting to external circumstances, but are proactively shaping our life's path. In Buddhism, this principle is embodied in the Eightfold Path, which includes right intention and right action, guiding us toward a harmonious and focused life. Creating a peaceful environment is essential for nurturing inner balance. This could involve setting up a dedicated meditation space, reducing clutter, and surrounding yourself with calming elements such as plants or soft lighting. Regularly spending time in nature can also provide a grounding experience, helping to restore balance and focus. By cultivating inner balance, we create a solid foundation for a focused, purposeful life. This state of equilibrium allows us to navigate life's challenges with grace and wisdom, ultimately leading to a more fulfilled and peaceful existence. 15. Awareness. The concept of mindfulness, or asati, in Buddhism is fundamental. It involves being fully present and aware of where we are and what we are doing, without being overly reactive or overwhelmed by what's happening around us. As the Buddha said, do not dwell in the past, do not dream of the future, concentrate the mind on the present moment. This teaching highlights the importance of staying grounded and aware, a key to maintaining focus. The primary purpose of cultivating awareness is to improve our ability to focus and reduce the impact of distractions. By being aware of when our mind strays, we can redirect our attention back to what truly matters. The benefits include increased productivity, better decision-making, and a deeper sense of peace and fulfillment. One, mindful breathing. Begin with simple breathing exercises. Focus on each breath as it enters and leaves your body. This practice can anchor your mind in the present moment, making it easier to notice distractions. Two, daily reflection. Set aside time each day to reflect on moments when your focus wavered. Identify triggers and develop strategies to minimize them, such as setting boundaries for screen time or creating a designated workspace. Three, single tasking. Practice doing one thing at a time. Multitasking often leads to scattered attention and reduced effectiveness. Concentrate fully on one task before moving on to the next. Four, meditation. Incorporate meditation into your daily routine. Even a few minutes a day can enhance your ability to stay aware and focused. Think of your mind as a lamp lighting up a room. If the light is steady, the room is well lit and everything is clear. But if the light flickers, shadows and confusion emerge. Awareness acts as the steadying force, keeping the light constant and bright, ensuring clarity and focus. Buddhism teaches that our mind often acts like a monkey, jumping from one thought to another. This monkey mind can be tamed through consistent practice of mindfulness and awareness. As Thich Nhat Hanh noted, the present moment is filled with joy and happiness. If you are attentive, you will see it. By cultivating awareness, we can appreciate the present and focus on what truly matters. Balancing emotions and rational thoughts is essential for maintaining focus. When distractions arise, it's important to recognize emotional responses, such as frustration or anxiety, and address them calmly. Techniques like deep breathing or taking a short break can help restore balance. The intent behind cultivating awareness is to align our actions with our true purpose. By staying aware, we can ensure that our actions are intentional and purposeful, not driven by external distractions or internal turmoil. This alignment leads to more meaningful and fulfilling outcomes. Creating a conducive environment for focus involves minimizing distractions. This could mean setting up a quiet space for work or study, using tools like noise-canceling headphones, or setting specific times for social media use. These practical steps help maintain a space that supports awareness and concentration. 16. Practice. Buddhism places great value on the concept of right effort, one of the steps in the Noble Eightfold Path. This effort involves the diligent practice of positive mental states, 
and the prevention of negative ones. As the Buddha taught, what we think, we become. This teaching underscores the importance of cultivating positive habits through consistent practice, which shapes our minds and lives. The purpose of regular practice is to refine our skills and deepen our focus. Consistency helps transform practices like meditation and mindfulness from occasional activities into ingrained habits. The benefits include improved mental clarity, reduced stress, greater emotional stability, and an enhanced ability to stay focused on long-term goals. One, set a routine. Establish a daily schedule for your practice, whether it's meditation, mindfulness exercises, or another focus-enhancing activity. Consistency is key, so choose a time that you can stick to every day. Two, start small. Begin with short sessions and gradually increase the duration as your ability to focus improves. For example, start with five minutes of meditation and slowly extend it to 15 or 20 minutes. Three, mindful activities. Incorporate mindfulness into everyday activities such as eating, walking, or even doing chores. This practice helps maintain a state of awareness throughout the day. Four, reflect and adjust. Regularly evaluate your practice. Reflect on what's working and what's not, and make adjustments as needed to stay motivated and engaged. Think of focus as a muscle that needs regular exercise to grow stronger. Just as physical exercise builds muscle strength over time, consistent practice strengthens your focus and mental resilience. Without regular training, the muscle weakens, but with steady effort, it becomes powerful and enduring. In Buddhism, the idea of sunyata, or emptiness, teaches us that everything is in a state of flux. Regular practice helps us navigate this ever-changing nature of life with a stable mind. As Thich Nhat Hanh said, the practice of meditation and mindfulness helps us touch our true nature so we can live with ease and joy in the world. Maintaining a balance between emotions and rational thought is crucial in regular practice. This balance ensures that we remain motivated without becoming overly critical of our progress. Acknowledge emotions like frustration or impatience and gently refocus on the practice at hand. The intent behind regular practice is to cultivate a disciplined mind capable of focusing on what truly matters. This discipline not only enhances personal growth but also helps in achieving long-term goals and living a fulfilling life. Create a dedicated space for your practice, free from distractions. This space can be a quiet corner in your home where you can meditate or practice mindfulness exercises. A consistent environment helps reinforce the habit and signals to your mind that it's time to focus. As we conclude this journey through the principles of focusing on your life, inspired by Buddhist teachings, it's clear that the path to a fulfilling and mindful existence requires conscious effort and awareness. Embracing focus in various aspects of life, from understanding the root causes of distraction to cultivating inner balance, empowers us to live more intentionally and purposefully. Buddhism teaches us that the mind is everything. What you think, you become. This profound truth reminds us that by mastering our focus, we shape our reality. By being aware of our thoughts and actions, we can steer our lives in the direction of our dreams and aspirations. Remember, focus is not just about intense concentration. It's also about knowing when to let go, embrace the beauty of the present moment, and find joy in the journey itself. As the Dalai Lama wisely said, happiness is not something ready-made. It comes from your own actions. By cultivating mindful awareness and taking deliberate actions, we can create a life filled with purpose, joy, and inner peace. In this ever-changing world, the ability to focus on what truly matters becomes a superpower. It allows us to filter out the noise and distractions, enabling us to channel our energy toward meaningful pursuits. So, let's commit to regular practice, nurture our inner balance, and remain steadfast in our journey toward greatness. As you go forth, carry these teachings with you. Focus is a lifelong practice that requires patience, perseverance, and self-compassion. Celebrate your progress, cherish the moments of clarity, 
and continue to strive for excellence. Your journey is unique, and with focus and dedication, you can achieve anything you set your mind to. Stay committed, keep your focus sharp, and let the light of your awareness guide you to a life of fulfillment and happiness. Remember the power to transform your life lies within you. So, take a deep breath, center your mind, and step confidently into your future. If you found this video helpful and insightful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more inspiring videos and insights. Together, let's continue to grow, learn, and create a more peaceful world, one mindful moment at a time. Thank you for joining us on this journey.